Hey everybody, Mr. Regan here. And up to now, we've done a lot to analyze our design, figure out how Nisha Carr's feedback can help make our design optimal. We have uh, reflected on the types of trade-offs we can make to think about how improving certain criteria while fortunately making others maybe not so great. And we now are at the final phase of our, our final part of our design phase where we're gonna do one final set of iterative tests to see if we can make our design more optimal than it was. So we're gonna be going over how to complete the next round of iterative tests in your testing log and how to complete the optimal design table on the home page. So in the next task, your job will be to go through the steps and create three more treatments minimum you can make more if you'd like but minimum three more treatments to try to make your tests more optimal you also might have tests in your uh, iterative tests that are more optimal in some way than what you currently have nonetheless three more treatments minimum okay once you're done with those three treatments your job will be to complete the optimal design uh treatment design uh in your uh There it is, supply drop log. It's your optimal supply drop design. So what this is, is your final choice about what your most optimal design is. To fill this out, very simply, you're gonna go through all of your test results, all of your designs, and pick out the most optimal design after you've done three more tests. Whatever one you feel as you're comparing the results is optimal, you'll go to that number. So maybe it's number 15 or 23 or whatever. And you're going to fill out the building detail here, the results, and explain how your iterative testing led to your final test design being optimal. So why was this more or the most optimal compared to any other test results that you have? Your goal here is to use evidence from your other results to help explain why it's more optimal. Why is it more optimal for shell cost or cargo damage than others? So you're then going to screenshot this optimal design with your testing analysis down here to show that that is your most optimal design. That's what you're going to paste in there. So this should actually say optimal uh, supply drop. Design. There we go. Optimal supply drop design. So that's how we're going to do a la our last set of iterative tests. That's how we're going to complete our optimal treatment design screenshot. And that's how we're going to make our final choice. So take a minute. Do you understand how to complete the next round of iterative testing in your testing log and how to complete your optimal design table on the homepage? If yes, put it in green. If anything's confusing, put it in yellow or red and reach out. And as always, good luck.